have it by then, which I absolutely should. All right, what's up, bro? Let's get out of the game. Oops, sweet. Yeah, my, <laughs> my memory is faded. That was a that was a long time ago. Let's go. Three, three, two, one, go. Ah, oh, fuck! He got me. He got me. I need a real table. I woke up at seven, traveled from London all the way here. Really? Yeah. It's starting out in like in, in what sense? Like yeah. for what? Just like uh, working out and like trying to like go outside. I definitely. Uh, I mean, if, if advice starting out. I would really look for evidence to back up the things that you do and I would recommend maybe I mean in terms of developing your body doing maybe like full body workouts three to four times a week do heavy compound movements make sure your form is good always be like micro analyzing assessing your form to make sure it's getting better and better and better and just progressive overload eat food and just give it time that's the last variable how often you train in it right now yeah training's really not been that good right now because like a lot of traveling yeah, like now yeah, point yeah. when I travel I just like Training just goes out the window because sleep schedules get out of whack. My diet's inconsistent, but when I'm, gonna, when I'm when I'm gonna go home in a little bit, I'm gonna be home for like a decently prolonged period of time. So I'm really gonna get my training nailed down yeah, now. Yeah, but yeah. when I am like probably training, it's like six times a week, yeah, ideally. Yeah. And then how how long the sessions? How long? Sessions? I mean. There were, I'd say on average maybe about three hours, but it's not all like hardcore epic training for three hours. There's a lot of like resting in between yeah, yeah, sets. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, but I'm in the actual gym for probably like three hours. Yeah, okay. And then yeah. what, what do you like mainly focus on? Like bulking, would you rather? Like, right, I mean, as of right now, I, I want to bulk up. Yeah, even, yeah. even for the summer, I don't really yeah, care. Yeah. I want to bulk and I'm really working on my squat. I'm going to make some form adjustments. I want to squat 500. You guys were here yesterday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I remember. Yeah, no, I recovered. I slept for like 12 hours. I'm awake. I'm here. I am ready. Really? Yeah. My stepdad was with the Wayne and I would always like visit with Wayne. I'd take a 15 hour drive though, yeah. Oh my god, I've been watching for so long. Really? Honestly. Did you see me standing smiling? What's I was, that? I was standing smiling. Can I show you what can I, can I show you my physique and I say? I bought your program. Yeah? Um, but I'm gonna I'm, once I'm, I'm like only six weeks in, but I'll show you what I've, I've managed to do so far. Oh shit. Yeah, I know. Look good. I don't know why I'm so both um, structures on point, the insertions are there. Yeah, I'm hoping. More videos, you gotta do more. I will, I'm, I'm, so I'm working stuff, on that. See when you're, the old school videos when you would be like, the edits are fucking sick, but there's nothing better. I love watching all your old videos. Mm -hmm. See you're like 17, I'm 17. Yeah. And you were like deadlifting 500 pounds and shit like that. Yeah, no, I'm, so, I'm, I'm like, the reason I haven't really been uploading that much is I'm kind of like in a dilemma, like not knowing like what kind of videos to make because like so many people want so many different things. Oh, like I know, I some people will say, like, because I completely understand like the edits are all cool and shit, yeah. but like it's like the raw actual content yeah, that people want. Like, half an hour video with you and Dylan just fucking around. Like it's so funny just seeing you guys, like, honestly. Um, yeah. But like I'll let them go anyway. It was lo I fucking love you, man. Hey, man. No, thank you. I, I really appreciate the feedback. Thank you. I came from Uzbekistan for you. Uzbekistan. Yeah. Holy shit. Yeah. Yeah, were you guys brothers? Yeah, we're brothers. Both from Uzbekistan? Yeah. God. And we see every old vlog. So really? Much. Shit, thank you. Uh, Oops, fuck, scoring yeah, 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 yeah. 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 yeah, no, it's a very angel-like sounding language. Yeah. It sounds really cool. Thank you. Oh, no problem. You speak English? Yeah. Can you speak English? Because I feel like if I can't do a structured routine, then I kind of don't really have motivation to kind of come in and just do like a BS workout. So. I guess it's really hard like, with traveling and everything. Oh, yeah, no, traveling like demolishes. You yeah, have a lot of jet lag, or you kind of used to it. I've adapted like the other day, but yeah, jet lag is just another variable that just like fucks it even more. Me and my girlfriend watch you like every video you post, even if it's like two months away, I mean. Shit. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, like, I've taken like a film course at uni now, and like oh, Eric's film and, course. Like, yeah, the editing side. I love your editing style. Uh, That's thank, my main thing. Like, thank you. I, every time like you do your little like promo clips and everything like that, I'm just like the editing of it. I'm just like thank you. I'm, I'm, that, that, that does mean a lot to me. Yeah. This camera you use is like like a daily. Right now, we are using the Canon 1DX Mark II with a 24 to 70 f 2.8 Sigma art lens. I used to be a big Sony fanboy then. I was like, you know what, like, what the fuck am I doing with my yeah. life? Canon colors where it's at. Yeah. I want the 800 megabit a second, 60 frames a second, 4K. You got to get that. Dude, that's the thing. Like, I would rather be someone's assistant filming vlogs and editing oh, for, for them yeah. because, like, let's say like, I want to do something cool for video. Go to the beach and surf and shit, right? Yeah. I can't get drone shots or cool shots of me doing shit. Yeah. I get all, a bunch of cool shit of my friends, right? But I can't get it of me so I'm just like fuck I'm currently grooming one of my friends to like be the cameraman and like learn how to like edit and everything yeah. that yeah. not not the edit part I'll, I'll always be doing that it's cool but it's what they use for like the actual blockbuster movies a digital domain DaVinci Resolve uh, that's more for color oh yeah that's for wait they use like 
Because no, I think for the high-end movies, they send it to like a studio where like the computers don't even have an operating system. The editing software like is the operating system. I know one of the companies is like Digital Domain. Oh, really? What, how would you recommend Vulcan? I mean, it really depends. Because like for me, like in high school, my objective was to like bulk as long as possible, for, like literally forever, right? But I would just happen to get lean when I'm like sick or my appetite's low. But I mean, if you want to have a successful bulk, I would have like at least like six months, like six to eight months. Or you don't even have to have a specific time frame. Just bulk for as long as you feel like you want to. And then when you feel the need to like lean down, you think you have enough muscle mass, and you want to be lean for a certain occasion, summer, whatever it may be, then it's like go on a uh, cut. But to have like a successful bulk, there's no, you're kind of defeating the point by making it short. So have it for like a, a decent chunk of time, like. Like maybe like six months at least. So is it true you eat as much carbs as possible in the bulk? I try, yeah, I try to, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah I try to like get in just enough protein, like maybe 150 grams, eat as many carbs as I can, and the fat just kind of like fall into place yeah, yeah. with all the food that I'm eating. Alright, it's to meet you. Yeah, man, it's a pleasure. Thank you for coming, bro. I go to school here, but yeah. Uh, so you're like, you're like commuting or like? Uh, I, I just do like university here. It's uh, so much cheaper, so. It's so like cheaper. Cheaper. How old are you? Uh, 19. Damn. Believe it or not, I used to be big, but I, I can't. You used to be big, so I, I have a I have a picture I was gonna show you actually. Let's see it. Used to be, but not any not anything like fuck? that anymore. That it was like back in the good old days. It was when I used to I used to watch your videos like every single time vlog came out, I'd watch it like straight away. Like Can I, I just wanna show the camera this. He was like, Yeah, like I used to be big, I used to train, then I'm like, ah, like fuck the hat, like I'd rather do other things. Well how old are you here? That was seventeen. Yeah. Dude, if you like train for six months, you can like yeah. take the Olympia if you yeah. want. That's insane. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, man. Hopefully, Hopefully you'll start training again. Yeah, yeah, for sure. I'm trying to get back into it. Dude, it do it. How would you train lower chest so it doesn't become too bloated? Like, like have that saggy look? Yeah, I don't want well, to like, keep it tight. Well, you, the thing is, you don't really have that much control over it because how someone's chest looks. Like, if someone has like a droopy, unattractive yeah. chest. It hardly ever has to do with the fact that they're overemphasizing in a training. It literally almost 99% of the time boils down to their genetic makeup of how their chest inserts. Yeah. When you're training the chest, there's no real weight. Like if you like do things like decon, yeah, you're isolating the lower chest yeah. a little more. But I mean, if you just want to avoid it at all costs, just don't do any decon movements. Like for me, for the whole chest in general, I think incline is like literally the best. Because yeah. even though you're lifting less weight when you're doing incline, you have a greater, greater range, greater range of motion and contraction, and like you're more primarily focusing your upper chest, so it has that like nice aesthetic look. So. I would honestly do like full range of motion incline stuff, like incline uh, barbell, like touch your chest all the way down. Incline dumbbell is one of the best things, but yeah. yeah or, hey, it's 2018, the way times are evolving, you can get fucking, like, you get your chest reinserted, like get fucking surgery for your chest and get it rearranged. No, I'm joking, don't do that. You should start posting more videos. Dude, I am. I'm like in a dilemma. Like, I like don't know like what kind of like stuff well, to post. I don't know. There, you used to be so big. What? Yeah, stop watching yeah no, he, he showed me a fucking picture when he was 17. I yeah, lost yeah. my shit. Like, like that's just ridiculous. Like, I don't know why he stopped training. Well, your edits are crazy. Like, that's why I love Thank watching you. your videos. So sick. Thank you, man. But like, if, what kind of content would you want to see? Like more of like what you do, like editing those videos, you know. So you like like fancy like edits or like, cause yeah, like those fancy edits and like a bit like, of raw vlogs in between. Yeah, because like, I really like doing fancy edits and stuff. That's what I'm most passionate about. But like, yeah. I, like people like them and stuff. But a lot of people say they want to see like raw footage and like what's actually happening. So you are such an inspiration, man. I'm Thank serious. you. My name's Matt. I'm a huge fan. You need to start uploading more often, man. <clears throat> I know. I'm like I don't know like. I'm like trying to like figure out like what to post yeah, like anything fitness food anything you got just post it because I love watching that shit I know I was with my friends we came here at 2 a.m. To, to line outside fuck yeah and with, to meet you guys and just keep doing what you do keep posting man because we want to okay. see that shit that like hearing this stuff like like does motivate me because I do get in like a rut when I'm at home like trying to figure out what to post so I, I don't know what to post <laughs> no, 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 no. like if you could have any if you could have any type of video what would you want I just like days in the life, like yeah, what you smoking. do. Days in the life. Anything like also traveling as well. If you're yeah. gonna do any of that, traveling and everything like that. Because you live in a nice area, you. And what's it? What's it like working at Gymshark? Yeah, like right when I started working out, when I was like 13, 14, like, I was a huge fan of Gymshark. Like yeah. I followed all their stuff. I followed all like all their people that they sponsored, and when they like reached out to me, like it was literally like the happiest day of my life. So like, yeah. it's kind of like a dream come true in a sense. Like, I really, really like it. Awesome. How do you like get? Massive muscles like that. Like, I mean, I go to the gym and I can lift a lot, but like, I don't have huge muscles. Well, I mean, whatever you lift, you gotta strategically find a way to like lift more and like that enhances progressive overload. Yeah, so yeah. getting stronger and like doing a lot of volume and just giving it time. 
yeah. just have to get stronger and, I mean, yeah. Yeah, good stuff. Anyway, yeah. nice to meet you. I'm running new program at the moment. Are you? Kicking my ass. The bench programming's really good. There's any other strength program I've run before. It's just like fried me. My CMS is just dive. I want to get my bench up to 315. 315? For example, if I hit three plates here in the UK, because the plates are 20 kilograms, not 20.4 like in the US, that's like 308. But it yeah. looks like 315, so. Exactly, that's the one. That's, that's the cheat code. That's what I like. Um, do you mind if I get another picture yeah. of the wingspan one? I reckon oh, I can wingspan. Take you for that. Yeah, let's go. Let's do it. <laughs> I'm fan fucking tastic. Don't need, be nothing. Better. Don't need nothing. Don't need shit. My man, my man, Steve. My man. Steve yeah. Sorry, sorry. Real, real quick. He looks like Dylan. I, I, I kind of see. Yeah. You look like Dylan. Dylan McKenna. Oh yeah. Badly. Oh, you line skip. Ah. I won the push-up challenge. Ah shit. You fucking look like it. Yeah. That makes sense. What do you like into calisthenics? Um, bit, everything. Oh, everything. A little bit of everything. So, I'm, like, I'm not amazing at one thing, but I'm really good at everything. So I've been crazy today. Oh yeah, dude, it's insane. I wasn't here in the morning, but apparently it was just like, woo! We've literally been here since five, so we've been here all day. Like five. Oh my god, oh. Oh. one of the inspiration for my friend. Really? Everybody was sharing, God, well, I'm originally from China. Mm -hmm. All my friends was sharing your photos when you were 16 years old. Oh. And what do you make you become today? Wow. It was so inspiring. You never know how much influence you have it with that, but you didn't mean a lot of influence. Say that again, glass part. But like, you never know how much positivity you give it to people. But like, yeah. all my, all my friends, when they know you, they inspire them a lot. Thank you. I mean, that's why I like these events because when I'm just like home alone, like it's hard to tell. Meeting actual people, like I get to realize that it's really cool. Let's go, on, there you go. I'm good. Wow, it's good to meet you, man. Pleasure. Love your videos, bro. Thank you. Changed the way I train. Like always doing deadlift, squat, bench. That's even, where it's at. Even been doing the. Um, Texas Deli on the bench, uh, bro. You cheater. I'm gonna get a max on that. It, it worked, man. You like it? It works? Oh, max. yeah. You learn yeah. how to use it or you get that pop. Yeah, boom, boom. boom straight out. Yeah, yeah it's a shoot. Yeah, yeah, massive fan of YouTube, man. So. Thank you. How, you how long are you here for? Uh, I'm here for, um, I'll, I'll leave the 20th, but I'm gonna be in Birmingham for a few more days. I'm gonna go to London, hit up Harry Potter World. Oh, oh no! no. I've done like 250 years now. All good, all good. Oh, all good. What, 86500? Yeah, yeah. Good shit, good shit. Like I've, up, I've upgraded to uh, the, one D, where, yeah. the 1DX Mark II. Yeah, sick, man. Yeah, cannon colors that for the wind. That building is insane. Oh, yeah. Man, it was nice to meet you. It's a pleasure, bro. I'll see you later. Messages before he goes up to Everest. It's alright if I get like 10 seconds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. Wait, well, he's doing it for like a charity, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Just when you're ready. Cool. Yeah. Alright, so my boy Sean Stafford, the universal athlete, is going to risk his life for a charity. He's going to Mount Everest to run a marathon and I mean I cannot think of a less ideal place to run a marathon so the fact that he's doing that and if he makes it out alive and if he wins that's just like the most savage thing like you could possibly do so Sean I really hope you don't die if you win that's great but try not to die. Have fun. If you have to do one lift for the rest of your life what would it be? No, do you have one See that, that, that's an interesting question because at that point it's kind of like because I want to have a good physique and if I can only do a certain lift do I want to do a lift that optimizes how I look or I can't find a lift that's good enough for that, so I'll just do a lift that I enjoy doing the most that disregards my physique. But if I had to say, it would probably be... Squats. Yeah, um, Yeah, no, it would be squats, yeah. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. But, but, uh, but every time I go to the bathroom, I try to sneak in some pull-ups or something while God's not watching, so... I'll figure out a way. Oh, oh the DEP? Yeah, yeah, it's so good. Doing like the deadlift twice a week, the legs, but then by the end, no, it's really good, so. Yeah, like That's the longer cool. you do, the more consistent you'll stay. You'll be, you like won't even be sore yeah, at all. No, I bet you're not even training that much at the moment. Right, the moment. yeah, at the moment, yeah. It's been like so snap, like. Cheers, mate. Thank, cool. you, thank, you. thank you so much. Thank you. God, thank you for much. coming. That means yeah, a lot. I appreciate that, bro. Thank you very much, mate. Take care. What's your favorite shoulder exercises? Because I noticed you very I really like seated overhead shoulder press with a barbell with like a really really big arch so it's kind of not like strict and a little bit it's kind of like right in between incline and seated shoulder press but I like it because I can go really heavy and it's easier to progress with the overload with like the micro kilo plates but yeah I'd say that and obviously dumbbell shoulder press and laterals those I'd say those are my favorite yeah yeah no I, once when I started getting really strong on laterals like heavy that's what I really noticed kind of like a fucking like a fatter like down yeah, I like laterals a lot. Do you do vlogs in the iPhone camera? Yeah, like 
half my vlogs are usually filmed on an iPhone because like if you have a big nice camera like that, yeah the quality is amazing but you're not going to be able to get like the cool shots in the moment. Yeah. That's where like an iPhone comes in so quality isn't absolutely everything. You gotta have to have that balance of like ease of use and like accessibility. Also, I love the program as well. Oh you do? Yeah, yeah oh, we did it. Dad, it's awesome what you're doing. Oh, thank you. Really inspirational for, for me to lose fat on here. Cool. And then we've been going to the gym now two months now. Two months? How old are you? I'm 21. Okay. I, I won't fit in a medium, so that's how much I've lost now. Damn. And it's just feeling amazing. I looked in the mirror, I, I hated myself. So yeah, no, like, I know what that's like. Watching all of you guys, it's just like, I don't have anyone around me that's, that does that kind of thing. Yeah, so, you, you, you got to find them, surround yeah, yourself with them. So watching on YouTube, that's my, you're the, your guy, you guys, the closest to me. Because you're, you know, you're in there, you've been there, you're doing it, and, you know, you give the advice that I want to hear. Okay. And it's just like perfect to motivate myself and keep going forward. So thank That's you very good, much. dude. That, that means a lot to hear that, man. Thank no you. Problem. Keep it up. Now it's time to slap on some muscle and fit that meat and fit that large. I used to train every single day. Now he just stops. He never train. He always makes excuses. So and his name is Jake? Yeah. He, he trained like a power lifter? He just trained like normal. Okay, okay. Jake? Jake, the word on the street is like nine different people came up to the streets and was like, yo, Jake, stop training. Like, that's an issue. You can't just train and then stop. That defeats the whole purpose. Like, you got to get back on that grind. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Fuck you, dude. Come on, Jake. They pushed me to the limits. I would never exceed that. I would never fall. Really? Like, my deadlifts. I would never think I would hit 100. And now I'm hitting 170. Is it because I'm watching you? Are you thinking of competing in the future? Yeah. Uh, in powerlifting, yeah. Powerlifting, not for sure. Highly, highly unlikely, but you never know. Anything yeah. can happen. I could change my mind, but powerlifting for sure. I'm gonna do that. Yeah, let's go, let's go. We're like the Avengers, but we're yeah. all Black Panther. And we're all alive. Ivan. Ivan. Yeah, yeah. Ivan. And also, I have a very specific question. Yes. Because let's do it. Uh, when it comes to training back, I always find that really hard to find that isolation back. The, the, the mind muscle connection. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I mean, here's the thing. Pull-ups is like one of the greatest exercises for the back and I know that feeling you feel it in your biceps You really don't feel like your back is working, but it really really is and if you're getting strong That's good But one tip that I would give for a better mind muscle connection So anytime you're doing any type of stretching so for example see the cable rows you're yeah. stretching your lap pull downs You're stretching yeah. here. So instead of relaxing everything and having everything fall forward yeah. You're kind of losing tension off the muscle you want to keep your shoulder back and your scapula retracted yeah. while still stretching forward because that way the muscle is actually being stretched. You're not just relaxing and stretching your tendons in a sense. So, for example, for CDK bros, instead of doing that, stay here, stay tight. So, yeah, keep keep your shoulder blades down packed when you're doing any type of pulling movement. And if you're doing pull-ups full range of motion, it's literally impossible to not activate your back almost to the max. Yeah, but I find it really hard to do, do pull-ups. So. Start with a... Start with assisted pull-ups and work your way to because oh, like pull-ups are like yeah. the number one exercise for back pretty much. Do you do a traditional deadlift? Yeah, just... yeah, no, I perform on my maxes sumo because I have such a better leverage and I can lift like almost 100 kgs more. But I do like all my actual deadlift work conventional because that's like my weak area and like has such a greater range of motion. It's actually helping me build more muscle and strength than if I just did sumo.